Hey y'all, I'm back with another video. Princess Chi, that is, who channel you watching? It's really an intro to a, maybe a voiceover. I don't know if I'm gonna do a voiceover. Maybe I just put words on the screen, I don't know. But it's really a, a segment of a hygiene series that I might store. So we gonna get into the video of my shaving routine. And the thing is, I only shave one of my body parts, which is my legs. I was going to take y'all through waxing and shaving with me at the same time. But I haven't got, it's not my wax day. I haven't got no wax. So that's going to be a whole different separate video. Which, if you get my drift, is a part of the series. So that video is going to be a whole different video to this one. So this one is just, just my shaving routine. You know, on how I keep my legs nice and smooth. How I avoid stra having strawberry legs. Which I know is a common concern for girls. And how I have a nice smooth shave with no cuts. You shouldn't, you shouldn't have no cuts. This routine, flawless skin, no marks, none of that. So it's just flawless skin, a smooth, perfect shave on the thighs all the way down to the ankle to, or to toes if you be having hair on your toes because some people have hair on their toes i know i do but that's tm motto but let's get straight to it because we don't need this intro part being extra long hey y'all let's get straight into it first y'all see my little ratchet candle but i first use when i get in the shower my two percent solicit acid um it's a very light scrub so that's why i go in and with my gloves too, which the solicit acid helps and stopping marks and all of that. Y'all see my little dusty gloves and y'all see me here just scrubbing my legs. It's better to scrub for longer, not harder. So I go in for a long time on those legs, not too long, but long enough to scrub when y'all can see my little hairs and stuff of you looking closely because I zoomed in for y'all. And... Oh, that's so blathering up real nice, too. <laughs> this is like some ASMR for real. But I just basically scrub for a long while. Then after that, I start to go in with my Dove, the Sensitive Body Wash. This literally works like a conditioner. It says sensitive, but it does have fragrance in there. But for some reason, it works like a miracle. It works, baby. It works. It's just get all the hair off your legs. None of that razor getting stuck. None of that. Got to search for some oil. But you must let it sit for two minutes. I put that up there. <laughs> you must let it sit for two minutes. And y'all see me doing a nice little slow. Make sure you do not push down on the razor. I even saw a hack somewhere where somebody said you could push the razor down, then pull up slowly but if you just doing a pull up in a rush make sure you do it lightly and then y'all see me rinse my little legs off after that y'all see my little the lotion i swear by you need to get you this if you not then you need to get it okay but i couldn't use that lotion sadly because i ran out so i went in with my hydro boost by neutrogenia and it did the job Obviously, I got to double up on Vaseline now. My bootleg on my petroleum jelly by um, Baby Love. I guess that's the Dollar Tree kind. But that one has a scent there. I usually go for no scent, but that's all I had. But now y'all seeing the result. Y'all see those nice, smooth legs. No strawberry legs, no cuts, no none of that. Um, Another take, zooming in. Okay, so on with the video. <laughs> okay, so now that y'all saw how I do that, which is I exfoliate my shaving and how I moisturize after all of that. I'm going to give y'all one hack before I leave, before I go. If you want a nice, silky smell, silky, I said silky, like silky with the gook. I'm just playing. But if you want a nice, silky feet, I don't do this all the time. But if you want a pamper day, after, you know, if you got a little hair on your little toes, whatever, you could shave your little toes. You could put Vaseline on your feet after you put your moisturizer, like how I did that combo. And put socks on your feet. And when you wake up in the morning, your skin will be so soft. Like any type of body part that you cover with moisturizer and Vaseline and then conceal, it will be feeling real, real, very silky clean. Like some people even do that with their hands and that's why they be having real smooth hands. I don't be worrying that much about my hands. I just try to stick with lo lotions on my hands when necessary so they won't be itchy 
but if you is somebody who want to achieve real soft feet or hands sleep with gloves and socks on and i know that's hard for some people but some people say that's serial killer vibes but i'm somebody who sleep in socks like i used to all the time i haven't lately because i don't be having no socks on me where i be sleeping at but i used to, used to sleep in socks like i'm a yeah one more thing i want to point out in the video if you notice I didn't use my coconut rescue lotion for my legs. I used my Hydro Boost because I ran out of my coconut rescue lotion, which I gotta get some more of that. But that's usually backup, like, because it works just as good. I just know with the Hydro Boost, I sh for sure have to go in with the oil on top because it don't provide as much moisture as the coconut rescue. But I'll go in with Vaseline on my legs, but I do not put Vaseline nowhere on my shoulders or anything like that. but we've just focusing on legs because i'm gonna get into all that other stuff in a different video but thank y'all for watching please like comment and subscribe stay pretty stay blessed stay kind stay a little bit ratchet just case don't get ugly yeah bye y'all thank y'all for watching